everyone so here's my ender 3 pro and um, on this one i have got an auto shut off feature programmed in um, and a module um, so if we go to the back of the printer you'll see that there is a module just there which you connect in by disconnecting the two power leads and then there's an in and out for the power lead and it takes the original Y lead into one side and then there's an adapter lead that comes out to the Y uh, you know micro switch stopper at the back there um, and then once it's switched on there's a little switch to connect it a little blue light comes on to say it's active and I've adjusted the g-code so that when you finish your print the bed on the Ender Pro doesn't come to the front to present you with the item like it used to. Um, it will go to the back and it will sit against the, um, the the rear stopper on the Y, which then activates the timer on the little module and then it kills the power to the machine. Um, so this is really useful. That means I can do a nighttime print and uh, just go away from it and when it's finished printing instead of it staying on all night it just shuts all the power off um, and then all you have to do is toggle the power switch to reactivate it um, so it just gives you that peace of mind that this isn't switched on all night long they are really safe I understand that um, but it, it's, it's a better feature I think to have and it's a shame it's just not built in automatically to shut down after prints um, I'll leave the g-code in the description and a link to where I picked up the module uh, it's very easy to put together the casing on it is 3d printed and is pretty poor quality so it would be worth redesigning your own I think and then uh, reprinting one unless somebody can get a good STL file of uh, the original um, I found that the button on the casing didn't work very well I actually had to snap it off to make it function correctly and it's just an on-off function it doesn't come with any instructions it was just plug it in put the g-code in and then once it finishes and the bed turns off um, that's it ready to go um, so no reprogramming needed anything like that just the g-code in your splicer settings um in i was using cura and i've just put the end settings together so just copy and paste those into your end settings for yours uh, or make the adjustments required so that it goes to the back setting y to zero and that's it ready to go <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.